Hey guys, at the wood lot, packed up, ready to go. Got some nice seasoned oak. I'm gonna have lunch out here now. Just wanna show you something, this MS290 here. Cut like a bear, but on the way out, I left this tailgate open, damn it, darn it. And uh, fell off, broke the gas cap. I said, what am I gonna do? So I looked at the, the oil cap and uh, looked the same. So I just cut the little rope off it and put it over there, fit perfect. And I figured, well, okay, with this little oil business here, I'll oil it while I cut it, really cut well. But uh, I have to get another cap. Luckily, I could have ruined the whole saw, but it cuts good. So I'm just going to have lunch with my little day bag or whatever. I mean, I got everything, and I redid everything on the inside of the truck, but uh, packs. See what we got in here. We'll cook something up. And uh, long when I go on that tree, it doesn't look big. It's huge. It's doesn't look it from here, but uh, I just like just tip of the iceberg here. Cut a lot of all this down. Some of that down, it's wedged between that tree and up there on the hillside. So, I mean, it's four or five feet diameter. You can't tell from here, but a nice white oak good season. Been down for at least three years, but I've split it up. But uh, that's what I'm doing here, man. Oh, some lunch here. Can't build any fires out here. It's been real dry anyways. We've had storms, you saw that, but uh, a little five by uh, seven there. But, uh, there want some good coffee, instant coffee, man. That is the stuff. But, uh, hmm. I don't know what we'll have today. <coughs> this miso looks good, but uh, I'm not sure. <coughs> Let me get my... Uh, One of my kits. I got the canteen cup here too, so Let's see what we got. Oh, there's some noodles. Yeah. Sounds good. A little deflector. So let me get this set set up. And uh I'll get back there. I got the uh Bill Gowdy outdoors shirt. I, I gotta drop in there when it's not. Remember Steve Wallace, you know, lost his wife, so stop over, you know, give him a little comfort, he needs it, but, uh, just want to mention that, but uh, out here, man, it's God's country, this is real nice out here, but, uh, pretty good, so I'm going to get the stove ready and, uh, cook up something, maybe some tea and noodles and all that stuff, so, get back to you, I'm all cleaned up now my old shirt that I was wearing but uh okay take care it's that little Ozark kit from uh this particular bag from uh, Walmart yeah. so am I boiling the water first now Doing this first, kind of pre soak it a little bit. Get it cooked up. I'll leave this out, maybe a cup of tea after. I think I have some kind of chocolate or some kind of bar in there. So I'm going to get this stove going. Get back to my. Yeah, it didn't work. Goes. 
try that after after getting that going. Let's try again here. It, it wasn't stable. This wasn't stable. Should be all right now. Oh man. The hot sauce. Hot oil. Hot oil, I don't know. going right there. Looks pretty fast. How fast that is. Right on the top of this one. kind of noisy. I lost 15 pounds, I know it looks like. I don't know where to go, get rid of the spare tire. But, uh, it's not good today, but it worked pretty hard. But, uh, there's some noodles with some, uh, I'm going to say Izot, but that's the clean your life. Um, Herba. Uh, 
got more than enough here. It's perfect. It's just like one little bundle of uh, oil for noodles. A bird box. A pot of tapio. Uh, hot sauce. And I have some tea there. Now see that stove was new. I never used it before. And that piazza did not work. Never depend on that. Need a match. Uh, fill rod. Um, I've had trouble before. And sometimes if you have big wide pots on there, it's a little plastic that's on the button. That could melt on you. So just remember that. I'm not in the school now. So I'll get back to you. So I shut that off. Tea's ready, man. Just gonna let that. Not gonna be able to let that cool off. The noodles, I think, are just really excellent. Um, my little day bag, I got a little filter in there too. Uh, another spoon, a spoon that I made. Uh, all kinds of food here. Yeah, a lot of different bits of food here. Cordage. Whistle. Punk wood, fat wood, some jute. And I got uh, some more uh, tinder compass here, some foil, real good matches there from uh, Yuka. You dip these things in water, they light. I don't think I should go over everything, but uh, this is just a little poncho. I use it as a ground cloth. Got a lighter in here. Now on me, I always have a Swiss Army knife, ferro rod, P38 can opener, um, lighter, tar picks for fuel and playing. Got some cordage, some first aid tape here, hot chocolate tea, coffee. Tent, more cordage, or shelter here. Got all kinds of food in here. I'm not going to show that, but uh, some uh, number 36 bank line with some uh, a little toggle. Also some fat wood. Uh, nice headlamp. What else we got here? might have this with the tea. Use that up. Also have like a, a sheet. You get it at the dollar store. Use that as a uh, ground sheet. You can use them as shelter too, but uh, a potholder wool. A little smoking cap. Or Voyager hat. Whatever you want. Just a little uh, fixed blade knife. It's cross trail by Western. I was checking out some of the nice, very inexpensive full tang, pretty darn sharp. And uh, this knife here, this Mora, it's actually a Baco, but I, I carry that along with the Schrade uh, FCHF 36 in the truck. And in the truck is a, uh, there's actually two saws, but I have one I use, uh, I use a lot of Corona saws. But uh, yeah, and the stove. So anyways, there's enough to, uh, oh, there's more stuff. There's steaks, there's some first aid stuff. There's, uh, yeah, there's stuff here. There's more stuff here. But anyways, two containers for boil, canteen, obviously. Canteen cup, MSR cup, small one, 500 ml. Um, so we're in pretty good shape here. A little bag for the stove or for something. But um, that's that's just a uh, little day bag, you know. But uh, I'm looking at my food, I'm pretty damn hungry after working. But uh, work, work, hard work. Mm. Mm. -mm.
So I'll have noodles, a couple little blocks of herb box, just right. A little hot sauce, and you know, I can bring hot sauce with you. Um, but uh, got the stove. The stand, you got to play with it a little bit because sometimes it comes loose. I like the jet ball stand better, but that works. Um, but uh, yeah. Oh, excuse me. So finishing up my tea here. And uh no snack. Pretty good. And uh sent a little note. I used to watch these old movies and stuff, you know, the British out there drinking the tea in the desert and stuff like that. And, so what the hell are they doing drinking hot tea out there, you know? But I ended up over there. Best thing going was a nice cup of tea out there. The coffee was for garbage, you know? But tea is nice, clean, good. Sweat a little bit, cool you off. Pretty good, man. So I was Quinny Eskimo. I was out here. Got some firewood. Gotta go home. Unload this, I'll just throw it off the truck. The meal was great. Really good. Kit was not too bad. Just sort of weak. Good points, bad points. But uh, I don't cook it, but the food was great. Wow. Um, and I'm hungry. But uh, yeah, beautiful out here. God's country. So you guys take care. Glad you came along. Peace. Freedom. Keep your eye to the sky. Not a plane either. So you take care, man. Um, when you smell fair ride, take care, man.